Welcome to Endless Learning Training Series The Membrane-Based Desalination Technology. In this presentation we will about control valve versus shutoff valve and the functionality, fail-safe response, leakage class, can we use control valves for safety shutdown. Control valves regulate fluid flow by varying the size of the flow passage to control process parameters such as flow rate, pressure, and temperature. Shutoff valves completely stop or start the flow of fluid through a pipeline or system, providing on-off functionality. Functionality Control valves Control valves regulate flow, pressure, or temperature for process optimization. Shutoff valves. Shutoff valves completely stop the flow of fluid for safety and maintenance purposes. Control valves. They modulate flow to maintain desired process conditions. Control valves operate dynamically, continuously adjusting flow based on feedback. Examples. Globe valves. Butterfly valves plug valves, shutoff valves, they provide tight shutoff to isolate sections of a pipeline or system, shutoff valves operate statically, either fully open or fully closed, examples, gate valves, ball valves. Reliability, control valves, control valves are not designed specifically for emergency shutdowns, Control valves may not offer the same level of reliability in critical shutdown scenarios. Shutoff valves. Shutoff valves are engineered to provide quick and reliable closure in emergency situations, ensuring the safety of personnel and equipment. Fail safe features. Control valves. Control valves may not be able to achieve the same response time required for emergency shutdowns, potentially leading to safety risks or environmental hazards. Control valves may lack such fail-safe mechanisms, increasing the risk of failure during critical situations. Shutoff valves. Many shutoff valves are equipped with fail-safe features such as spring-loaded actuators or fail-close mechanisms. These features ensure that the valve closes automatically. Leakage Characteristics Control Valves Leakage Class Control valves are commonly categorized according to ANSI standard, leakage tolerance. Control valves usually have higher allowable leakage rates, common leakage classes, classes such as class 3, class 4, or class 6 are typical for control valves, allowing for varying degrees of leakage depending on the application requirements, typical leakage percentage. Control valves may have leakage percentages ranging from 0.1% to 1% or higher. Leakage classes. Classes such as class 6, zero leakage, or tighter tolerances are typical for shutoff valves, ensuring minimal to no leakage when the valve is closed. Leakage tolerance. Shutoff valves have much stricter leakage requirements compared to control valves since they are intended to prevent any flow when closed. Typical leakage percentage. Shutoff valves are often required to meet stringent leakage standards. With leakage percentages as low as 0.01% or even lower. Response time. Control valves. Control valves may not be able to achieve the same response time required for emergency shutdowns, potentially leading to safety risks or environmental hazards. Shutoff valves. Shutoff valves are designed for rapid closure to prevent catastrophic events such as leaks or spills. Thank you for watching this video.